What happens if a serpentine belt breaks while you are currently driving? Does your car stop moving? Ah, the serpentine belt, a crucial piece of your car's puzzle, winding through various pulleys like a serpent, thus the name. It's not something most people think about on their daily commute, but it plays a significant role in keeping your vehicle moving smoothly. But what happens if this vital belt snaps while you're breezing down the highway? Does your trusty steed come to an abrupt halt? Let's dig into this. First off, the serpentine belt is like the unsung hero of your car's engine, tasked with powering the alternator, power steering pump, air conditioning compressor, and sometimes the water pump. Essentially, it's a big deal. If this belt decides to call it quits while you're in motion, a series of unfortunate events will follow. The immediate impact won't be your car screeching to a stop. Instead, you'll lose power steering, making the steering wheel feel like you're wrestling a bear. This won't stop your car dead, but it's going to make maneuvering it a lot harder, especially at lower speeds. Next, your alternator stops charging the battery. Without the alternator doing its job, all electrical systems start draining the battery, with no recharge in sight. Lights, the infotainment system, and eventually the ignition system will begin to fail. This won't happen instantaneously. It'll be a gradual goodbye as the battery's reserves deplete. And then there's the air conditioner compressor. On a hot day in Portland, Oregon, losing the AC might not endanger your car's operation, but it can quickly turn your cabin into a sauna. Less critical than steering and power, but a quick way to make any drive uncomfortable. The real kicker, though, involves the water pump, which some car models run off the serpentine belt. If your car is one of those, the engine will start to overheat after the belt breaks. An overheating engine can cause severe damage if not addressed promptly. So, does your car stop moving? Not immediately. You'll have a grace period where your car will operate, albeit without power steering, and gradually losing electrical power, which may make you wish it had just stopped. It's essential to use this time wisely. Signal your intention, if your indicator lights are still working. Pull over safely, and turn off your engine to avoid further damage. The aftermath involves a tow and a visit to your local mechanic for a belt replacement, and potentially addressing any damage caused by the overheating. It's a stark reminder of the serpentine belt's importance, and why it deserves a bit of attention during regular vehicle maintenance checks. Stay ahead of these things. It's the difference between a quick pit stop and being stranded on the side of the road.